Yeah, those doors don't seem to be anything. Yeah, that is a nice touch, isn't it? I like I like all the music uh, remixes they did in this game. It seems like it's uh, creeping a little bit. I, I turned off Firefox before uh, starting this up uh, this time around, so I don't know what the deal might be. Okay, I got all my shit back. Yay. Holy crap! Snake, look over there. That looks like Merry Gear. Don't worry, Snake. According to the Ghost of Christmas Present, the Merry Gear can't be activated without the three passcodes. It's parked in the driveway there. Can destroy it before the ghosts get their hand on the passcode encoded in Saint Nick's brain. That thing is just an oversized anime mech figurine. Anacon, who's that sitting on top of it? Huh? Oh, looks like a postman. Special delivery, Snake. A sniper. Watch it, Snake. He's gone postal. I am the ghost of Christmas yet to come, and let me assure you, I am nothing in. Uh, I am nothing in appearance like the uh, ghost of Christmas past. I am the angel of death, the grim reaper, and rain or shine. And I like all, also the best is yet to come. The ghost of Christmas present, and the ghost of Christmas past in death. You achieved more than you could ever achieve in life. Ghost of Christmas past. I don't remember defeating him. We three, the sons of the three wise men. Yet only one could be rightful inheritor of the title of Father Christmas. The ghost of Christmas present. The son I mean, of I'm just standing here while he's Jack sniping away. A milk clogging buffoon. To bring happiness to the world in the form of milk. <laughs> As if such a thing were even possible. Once I recovered his father's. So you're lactose intolerant? Of little further use to me. And the ghost of Christmas past. Ah, the son of Saint Nick. The son of Saint Nick. Raised by his foster parents to deny the existence of his very own father. The fool knew nothing of Saint Nick, and even less of his passcode. I had no use for such a compatriot. So that's right, Snake. Are you aware of the Santa Claus? With Tim Allen? Yes. The Santa Claus. It is a rule, a curse of the Saint Nick line. When all belief in a Nick is lost, then that Nick shall simply disappear from existence. It was all just a matter of convincing myself that Nick Jr. was nothing more than a child's fantasy. But you haven't convinced himself yourself because you just... The title of it, uh... ha! I, the son of the little drummer boy, deserve the title most of all. Drummer boy. And anyways, the past and the present, what purpose do they serve than to pave the road for the future? But you still haven't figured out the last okay, the station. No, not yet. But now that I've got you here, it's only a matter of time. A postman Nick at night. Be, but it is you who has made the delivery this time, Snake. And I'll gladly pay the shipping and handling in bullets. You got an idea, Otacon? It seems like all of the ghosts are delivery men of some kind. And disgruntled ones at that. Maybe there's some way you can use his occupation against him. Kind of like you did with the milkman. Maybe we're just hiding a box. Ooh. 
Nope. There's going to be something important about that mailbox, because it is notated there. Hmm. Seems impossible for you to get anywhere near him. Maybe there's some way of getting him to come to you. Yeah, that's exactly what I want. Well, he seems to be aiming at your feet and not your head. Seems like he doesn't necessarily want you dead. Great. That's a comfort. Uh, get a hold of some anthrax. Um, sound of white noise caught in a mosh. You know, persistence of time. Of a uh, persistence of uh, time. God damn it, where's Scott Ian when you need him? This ghost is a postman. I was thinking, could he perhaps have a thing against digital distribution? Digital distribution? Yeah, the transfer of information across digital channels, like the internet. It only makes sense that an old geezer like the Ghost of Christmas Yet to Come would have a problem against a technology that's quickly making his own work irrelevant. Hmm, you're right. After all, this entire mission was transferred over the internet. The internet's bound to be able to transfer other things as well. Now, there is something in the uh, Mary Gear Solid 2 um, folder when everything is unzipped. It is a... Um, it's another zip file inside it that says package. But I got no idea of uh, what to do with it. Hmm. <coughs> Snake, try checking this game's directory for some kind of package to drag and drop onto the game window. Window? Directory? Drag and drop? What the hell are you talking about? Jeez, what? You never heard of a computer? Get with the times, granddad. There is also a README in here, so I'm going to look at that real quick. Uh, no, nothing of interest in there, so let's see. We're going to select Package. PSG? Great! You found the PSG! Finally! Give me something to shoot. Uh, sorry, Snake. PSG stands for Package of Sleep Grenades. Lame. The PSG contains one remote detonated grenade that emits a sleeping gas. Maybe you could use it against the ghost of Christmas yet to come. There's no way I'll be able to throw a grenade that far. Hmm. I'm hoping that was the right solution. Here he comes. Is he in a wheelchair? Now, special delivery. <laughs> Beat up a handicap, man. Okay. It's been a long time, Snake. Why not? It's all thanks to you, Snake, that I, Timothy Cratchit, will become the next Father Christmas. Timothy Cratchit? You mean your Tiny Tim, Saint Nick CEO, and Operation Secret Santa? Ha. They stopped calling me that years ago, after my father, Bob Cratchit, died of asphyxiation whilst lodged in a chimney. Do you know what he was doing, Snake? He was pretending to be Santa Claus for his children. Mm. How ironic it was that it was the Christmas spirit that stopped wow. the rhythm of Bobby. Totally taken from Gremlins. The boy Cratchit's heart. Then, of course, the media got wind of the story started calling me Tragic Tim. Tragic Tim? That's right, Snake. Born an invalid. Tragic Metal Gear. King of Christmas time. All I need from you, Snake, but we can do this the easy way or the hard way, is Santa's passcode. But I don't know Santa's passcode. I thought this was why you were going to bargain with the president in the first place. Ha! And risk getting the U.S. military involved? I think not. 
When I learned that Jack Frost had been defeated, I wondered to myself, could this be the legendary Solid Snake? Trying to throw another wrench into my grand plan? Another Maybe. <laughs> you still don't know, do you? Three years ago, I sent Saint Nick on a mission called Operation Secret Santa. Oh good, they'll never crack that code. 14015 Hideo Drive to deliver a Christmas gift to the 10th floor. I constructed that house, Snake. Impossible. Perhaps you didn't notice the outright lack of windows on the inside, in spite of them being on the outside, or the sheer number of infrared sensors, much more than would be necessary in any household, or perhaps the fireplaces without log racks didn't give away that they were, in fact, false fireplaces. It was a I just thought it was Michael Bay's house. Prison in which I would keep Saint Nick, torturing him until he revealed his passcode. Unfortunately, I ran into an unforeseeable inconvenience. <laughs> it could unforeseeable be. Inconvenience. You, Snake, you were not part of Operation Secret Santa. Had it not been for your assassination of Saint Nick, Operation Secret Santa would have been a success. And I would have become Father Christmas. Then, of course, the U.S. government took possession of Nick's body in order to cover up the death of Christmas. It was by chance alone that they left behind Santa's hand. I was left with no choice but to come up with another plan. A plan to negotiate for Nick's grave to uncover the passcode stored deep within He's talking a lot for a guy that just got put to sleep. to the SOC system, and for that, I needed to get in touch with Children of the Three Wise Men. The ghost of Christmas Pass. That's right. You see, Santa's hat could only be used by Nick Jr., Santa's son. Under the pretext. Nick Jr. can only air from 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. I created the ghosts of Christmas Pass. Little did they know that the Merry Gear was not actually a bipedal sleigh with the ability of launching gifts from any location. Wasn't? Of course not. What use would that be to anyone? No. The Merry Gear was actually a VR training simulation course designed to transform one person into the next Santa Claus. Good. Why would you want to do that? To bring an end to the tragedy of Christmas. The tragedy of Christmas? It was only by becoming Father Christmas myself that I could ensure the children of the three wise men would never be coming. By becoming Father Christmas, I could end Christmas once and for all. A world without Christmas. But what kind of world is that to live That's kind of pointless. <laughs> Snake, that's not something you'll ever have to worry about. Now tell me, Snake. Tell me you're unextracted from your brain. His passcode. I don't know Santa's code. Saint Nick's final words. Uh, Santa's last words were. Don't say them out loud. With it. Happy Christmas to all. And to all. A good night. Uh, sounded like the uh, soup was done. And we have credits. Well, um... I have no idea who's dead. Curious kid, the spinner kid, the classy kid, the foreign kid, the foreign kid. Oh, sissy kid, not sassy. Well, verify passcodes. Frosty Frost. Don't cry. I'll be back again someday. Entered by 
Jack Frost. Bob Cratchit. God bless us, everyone. Entered by Timothy Cratchit. Saint Nick. Happy Christmas to all. stop you from stepping into the merry gear. It's been a real pleasure working with you, Otacon. I want you to know that you'll always be a friend, even after I've become Santa Claus. You'll always be a good friend, too, Snake. Well, guess I'll be seeing you next Christmas, then, huh, Snake? <laughs> Not if I'm doing my job correctly. Merry Christmas, Otacon. Merry Christmas, Snake. Huh? Cindy Lou who? I can't let you step into that machine, Snake. For the position of Santa Claus has already been filled. Saint Nick, but I shot you in the head. Yeah. yeah. I'm not too pleased about that. But the true spirit of Christmas lies not within the head, but the heart. I'd anticipate. Oh, I was aimed for the center of mass. Start. How'd you do that? Why, my list of naughty and nice, of course. Once I discovered his intentions, I knew I had to stop him before he could fully act on his impulses. So I planted some information on the U.S. government's encrypted security channel, namely a tall tale about a project called Los Bigotes Perfectos. You made that up? I Big perfects? I planning a story about Metal Gear, I could get you to sneak into Tim's trap with me, and ultimately help me fake my own death in front of Tim's eyes. But what about Nick's, or your brain? Don't tell me it was just a pile of spaghetti or something. Just another piece of misinformation I planted after the secret sand incident. That was all it took to convince both Tim and the president of the brain's existence. Yeah, it did seem a bit hard to believe that your They saved St. Nick's brain! Shot in the head. So in the end, it all had to do with belief, huh? Belief is a powerful thing. Tim used it to deceive the ghosts of Christmas past and to end Christmas once and for all. But in the end, it was your beliefs that prevailed. I don't see what my beliefs have to do with anything. The Santa Claus, Snake. This entire mission would have been for naught had it not been for your belief in my existence. I don't believe in Santa Claus. I'm too old for that crap. Though you'd even see my dead body with your own eyes, in your heart you still held hope that I was alive. It was this belief alone that continued to allow me to exist long after the assassination. Well, just don't go around telling everyone. I've got a reputation as a hard mercenary to uphold. Your secret's safe with me. Well, I guess this means goodbye. Afraid it does. Chances are we'll never run into each other again. Not if we keep doing our jobs correctly, anyways. Goodbye, Snake. Merry Christmas, Santa Claus. <laughs> oh, God. The mission was a success. <laughs> Have yourself a Merry Christmas as well, Snake. And a Happy New Gear. And a Happy New Gear. I'm gonna guess that was a tranquilizer, cause uh, everything else has been non-lethal. So. I feel you approaching. I've waited all so Nick just be pure, popped him, or we're uh, passed out. And we're running the same uh, credits again. Uh, sure, why not? I wonder to myself whether you're real. <laughs> XH, be careful what you ask for, because if it does actually show up, I'm just going to feel compelled to play it. And holy shit. Why must you leave? I'll be rolling till Christmas Eve. 
some alcoholic mall Santa. Um, compared to what they could be uh, hallucinating. Happy sneaking wars covert. <laughs> the very next day you gave my position away. Thank you to Phil Fish there. Back when people wanted to thank him for anything. That work for you, Misfit. That's what I think of you. That's what I think of you, uh, Mary Gear Solid, too. Right here. So what happened? I don't know. It seems like I might have inhaled a bit too much of that sleeping gas. I can't remember a thing after I wished you a Merry Christmas. Hmm. Yeah, your codec call cut out there, too. Well, I assumed you'd gotten into the Merry Gear. I don't think so. Why not? Because when I woke up, the Merry Gear was gone. Oh. Well, at least we've got Tragic Tim. We can interrogate him once he wakes up. Yes. It all went according to plan. Yes. They all entered their passcodes. But the Merry Gear is safely out of their hands. Yep. It was yeah, lozenge there. Was hiding a package in the mission files. <laughs> they thought it was sleeping gas. Yeah, the poison gas was quite effective, as was the forgetting serum. He won't remember that we'd even met. He had no idea. I'm convinced he'd believe anything after all that double and triple crossing. The corroborating information we learned from playing Merry Gear Solid Secret Santa only convinced him further. With the VR training, my voice was nearly indistinguishable from the original. The bloodlines of the three wise men are cut, and the Merry Gear is ours. I'm looking astonished like I know who this is. Not a yeah. single person can get in our way. If only the three wise men had been more complicit. Not a single one of them entered their passcode when they had the chance. Yes, the ha he ho 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 shall rise again. The hoo ha ha and what now? Problems? I assumed it was just a matter of... Bah! Humbug! Then put the warheads into boxes, you nincompoop! Ebenezer Scrooge. Wow. <clears throat> Game time. 4 hours, 17 minutes, 11 seconds. Alerts, 92. Thrown enemies. I'm guessing that's Novocaine enemies. 113. Enemies polarized, 9. Enemies in love, 2. Enemies in love... Shots fired, 15. Total items, 9. Rank Mammoth. Yeah, which, uh, I was stomping around pretty good there. Um, I'm will. I'm hoping it, like, turned off the, uh, the countdown while the, the story was going on. But, uh, yeah, this is why I don't play stealth games very often, folks. But that is Merry Gear Solid 2, Ghosts of Christmas Past. I have no idea if there's a Merry Gear Solid 3. Um, if there is, um, maybe I'll play it next year, you know, just complete the Christmas pain trifecta. Um, but, uh, you know, in the meantime, um, 
I had a uh, fun time playing this despite all of the uh, chaos and confusion. Um, I got to get a lot of anger out uh, shiving kids. So, you know, I recommend that for a fun time if uh, you ever need to get some aggression through. So, uh, that will be it for this. Uh, so, take care, everyone. Uh, thank you for coming by. And uh, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, um, just joyous miscellaneous, whatever you celebrate. So, take care until we game again. Hmm. Still tastes weird. <laughs> This episode's delivery down the digital chimney was made possible by Mike Panza, Rick in Baltimore, Diodi, the post-production work of Matthew Carr Anderson, and all my sleigh riding like anthro fans. Thank you very much for your continued support. I hope whatever you celebrated this month was 100% as awesome as it can be. Take care until we game again.